on the new cruise, uh, we really wanted to tap into uh, the target audience mindset. Uh, and what we really went after uh, from our research was that the consumer that we wanted to target is somebody who's very confident. Uh, they, they're successful, but they continue to seek more success and more power. Uh, they're, they're not usually followers. Uh, they want to make independent choices in life, and they want to stand out in the crowd. And that really aligned uh, with the space that we're moving Chevrolet into, and especially uh, the, the cruise owners who are actual driving enthusiasts, uh, people who actually enjoy driving the car themselves. And that's what the cruise is about. The true uh, experience of a Chevrolet cruise is about driving itself. Uh, driving the vehicle uh, by themselves and not being driven. And that's really behind the essence of our campaign about independent thinkers and people who do their own thinking. General Motors does have uh, different brands uh, around the world, but uh, Chevrolet is our true uh, homegrown global brand. Uh, it is represented in more than 115 countries. And it really is the brand that we feel for short, mid and long term is the right strategic brand uh, within the context of India. So uh, our focus and our commitment is behind Chevrolet and that's what our strategy is moving forward uh, within the Indian market. Our overall marketing strategy uh, is, is a three part strategy really, is, is first of all to bring the the right product uh, that the consumer is demanding, uh, a product that's made in India and made for the Indian market. That's one of the key pillars uh, of, of our marketing strategy. The communication piece within the marketing strategy is going to really hone in, similar to what you've seen with the Trailblazer and Cruise. Yes, we're gonna be uh, leveraging uh, a global platform, which is Find New Roads, which is based on having uh, an emotional connect with the consumer. And it's all going to be about telling stories. But these stories are going to be told in the context of India. So our communication is going to be very global in touch and feel, but very local in content. And the third key piece of the marketing uh, communication piece uh, will be a very, very heavy use, uh, or I, I would say a very um, strategic approach uh, in digital and mobile platforms. And we're really looking to leveraging these two mediums with the exponential growth that we're anticipating in connectivity in India uh, and, and leveraging this platform to driving our overall communication message. There's absolutely no doubt. For, from an importance perspective, uh, General Motors or Chevrolet, I would say, has three big priority markets. Americas, India, and China. And that was clearly exhibited uh, by the announcement that we made with over a billion dollar investment, uh, which will be a sustainable investment in India over the next three to five years, uh, 10 new products, and a complete rejuvenation of the brand and the communication platform that you've seen. So if you're asking commitment, General Motors is committed to India in the long run, both from an industrial uh, perspective, both from a consumer perspective, but most importantly, we want to be part of not only the growth of the automotive sector in India, but also be part of the mobility solution uh, uh, within the context of the Indian society. If you look at uh, General Motors or Chevrolet specifically, uh, again, we are in the forefront. If we go back to 2009 and 2010, uh, where we were the first company to announce the extended range electric vehicle, the Chevrolet Volt, which was actually showcased at the Delhi Motor Show back in 2014. Uh, and recently at the Detroit Auto Show, we announced the production model of our first uh, uh, extended range um, uh, extended range uh, battery vehicle which will you know get in excess of 200 miles per hour uh, 200 miles extended range on the uh, on, on a single charge so I would say from a greener vehicle uh, perspective uh, the um, uh, the full electric vehicle extended range battery vehicles are definitely a lot more greener in addition to that the portfolio that we offer has uh, a balanced approach between biofuels uh, from the traditional fossil fuels. We have powertrains that are hybrid, fully hybrid. Even within the context of India, as we move into the next generation products, uh, you will uh, see technologies come in such as 
uh, stop start technologies which deactivate uh, uh, the, the engine during idle situations, which will again improve the level of emissions that are released. So uh, if, if we look at from very long term sustainable technologies to short term immediate solutions, General Motors within its portfolio of technologies has a solution in every one of those categories. So I, 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 would, I would like to believe and, and say that uh, we're, we're a great uh, part of the overall solution in reducing uh, uh, carbon emissions from automobiles.